Two weeks ago, Boyle Street unfortunately received an abhorrent and disgusting voicemail to our, our main phone line. It occurred on November 11th. Uh, day after the SDAB hearing about our new facility. In that voicemail, uh, an individual uh, takes aim at our organization and the people that we serve. He calls on them to be left, uh, to leave downtown, and, uh, and just says some absolutely disgusting things about the people that we serve. He takes aim at a marginalized and vulnerable population, and he takes aim at a helping organization that aims to serve those folks. Um, it's very concerning for us as an organization uh, if someone is willing and able to uh, say those things publicly and directly to us. We, we only imagine what people are saying behind closed doors and, and could be saying behind closed doors. Over 75% of the people that we work with at Boyle Street are of Indigenous descent and for someone to make such uh, inappropriate and awful comments about our community we find just so problematic and challenging. We have reported this uh, event to the police. Uh, it is considered a hate incident uh, and so as soon as we our senior leadership was aware of it uh, we took it obviously very seriously and have contacted EPS and reported it as a hate incident you know we, we've ha hit a bit of a snag with our development permit uh, you know I think it's important to note that uh, appellants argued against uh, uh, our building by describing our cultural indigenous cultural supports as recreation facilities uh, the, the, they are not they are health facilities and we found that aspect of the ruling incredibly problematic um, and so because of the problematic nature of the ruling that was made against our building uh, we have multiple avenues to move forward and we'll be uh, we'll be doing so in the coming weeks days and weeks the proposed location on 107a avenue 101st street we're going to continue to move forward with that location as the new home and headquarters for boyle street community services the king thunderbird center uh, the headquarters for boyle street community services uh, will be opening on the location on 107A Avenue and 101st Street. Uh, we have multiple avenues to move forward and we're going to take them. These conversations around these services, very rarely is it ever actually uh, about uses. This is really, people are talking about users uh, and uh, that's problematic. We need services now, we need them desperately more than ever. Uh, and so, um, you know, what what this voicemail signals for us today is very, a very concerning trend that we saw throughout our engagement process uh, of people using very stigmatized and, and discriminatory language about our population to essentially argue for them to not receive services.